Hello and welcome to the Rapid Solution channel. I am Rafael Ademo. In today's tutorial, we are going to learn how to remove or hide the user from title bar using the window handle API. In previous tutorial, I have introduced you to the window application program interface known as API. Using the Windows API, you can develop applications that run successfully on all versions of Windows. In the designing process, you are more likely to want to hide the title bar of a user from when you want to add progress bar to your application, such as you have here on the screen. And in order to create this UI design, download the code which I have added in the comment section and open it in an editor of your choice. I am using the VS Code editor as my text editor. Copy the code as directed and paste the code in the user form declaration area. Let me go into the VB editor and then stop the application from running. Go to the insert and then insert a new user form. Let me just add a few controls to this user form. Let me add the label, a label, a text box and then a command button with the back color let me change it to this deeper one and then run the code when i run the code you will see that this user form comes with a title bar so let's exit go to where we have downloaded and saved the code copy this these lines of code copy it and then go back into the design let's double click to take us into the code and paste it here these functions that i have declared here is simply telling the window handle to get the window handle associated with it and then pass on the values that the window handle will find based on this declaration to the user form this I have explained in the previous tutorial, add, minimize and then maximize button to the user form. So if you have not watched that tutorial, please do so, as it would give you a better understanding of the, the work that the window handle does in collaboration with the Windows API. After you have pasted this, let us go back to our code and then copy this line of code. Let's copy it out and then back in our design in our code session. Let us now select user form and then go to the activate procedure. So we are going to paste that code in the user form activate procedure. You, you can either paste it in the user form initialize event also. So let us paste it here. What this line of code is doing is that it's telling the window handle to find the user form and its properties. And then after that, the window handle determines the new style that has been defined by this function here and then passes it on to the user form. And with that, the work of the API is done here. Let me comment this out. They set the window long. So let me comment it out and then run the code. You will still see that the user form comes with the regular title bar. Let us exit and then go back to the code and remove the comment. And this time around, run the code. You will see that the user form now appears different from what we have what we have seen previously. This is because the Windows API is asking the user form to appear without any title bar and then appear with this new style. When the user form is designed this way, you would either have to add a code to terminate the user form after a time or you add an exit button to the user form because without the title bar you would not be able to access the close button from here so let me come here and then stop the code 
With that, we have come to the end of this tutorial. Thank you for staying and spending your precious time with me to learn how you can hide or remove the user form title bar. Do not forget to subscribe to be the first to be notified when next I release another exciting tutorial on the use of Windows API in the VBA designing process. Give me thumbs up if you have found this tutorial exciting, informative and educative. And as always, I look forward to your comments and suggestions which I highly appreciate. Thank you and bye bye for now.